they call it al dente hello and welcome everyone uh, tonight is the first of the two good to go series I have tonight a carvery uh, it's a meat free carvery unfortunately so it's just veg um, but there's a lot of it <laughs> I've got myself a drink here as well don't usually have a drink but tonight because it was a pub meal I thought I'd have a drink the uh, the beer that I had whilst waiting for this was absolutely awful that's why I thought I'd have this one it was an IPA this is stout okay so we've got a, a bag it was help yourself unfortunately I've torn it on the way back um, they gave you uh, a bag a box and a tub to put your gravy in uh, which I managed to spill a little bit uh, so what I have here let's just bring the bag up I'm not going to get a plate because there's too much here whoa look at this now that is a lot I'm going to tear the box so you can see what's in here you're getting it Now this came to three pounds and twenty nine pence, and there's a, a whole lot of food here. It's got stuffing, parsnips. Um, I presume this is red cabbage. Lots of roast potatoes. Got some gravy here. Mmm. Yorkshire pudding, a bit dry now, it's the end of the night, so, some sprouts, try it. Roast parsnip. Mm. I'm glad they got the gravy. I'm impressed that they gave you a tub to take the gravy home with. That's nice. Nice touch that. There was absolutely no meat left, so. I presume they've got it down to a T that they use up all of the meat. Got a boiled new potato with some herbs on it. A bit of gravy. I could have filled that up more actually. Only two thirds filled that. Now on the app, it said that the box would be ready for you to collect. Now, I think most places do that system, so it is a magic box. That's what they're sold as. But because this is um, like a self-service carvery, I presume you know, the same thing applies. You know, just you get given a box, you get given a tub, and you fill it up with what you want. Oh. Got some carrots poking through here. It's very nice. It's, it's um, it's still hot as well. But for like three pounds twenty nine p, that is a lot of food there. I think there's actually more than I'd usually put on my plate. Well, maybe about the same. I know I had more roast potatoes than I usually do. I 
although they are um, processed roast potatoes, they're not always, but these ones are. What I mean by processed is um, it's basically mashed potato formed into a roast potato and um, <clears throat> may even be coated with something. They're very nice, but um, very like starch, potato starch. Now I think they put wine in the cabbage, like red wine maybe. Just I'm getting a bit of a wine flavour. Or maybe wine vinegar, I don't know. Cooking cooking wine, that's it. I think that's what they use. I was going to get a um, Slim Chickens uh, Too Good To Go box and also um, a Gourmet Burger Company because they both use um, Sainsbury's uh, supermarket. Uh, so they're both in the Sainsbury's supermarket so I was going to buy one of each and um, you know bring them back and see what you get. Uh, but they had all sold out so you know tonight this is what I got, the uh, carvery. It's called trimmings. I presumed it was going to be meat, but it's not. It's just vegetables. So, I don't know. There's some mashed potato here. The stuffing is just usual stuffing. I think it's... um sage and onion, you can taste uh, sage and onion in it. Now let's try the uh, mashed potato. Mm. It's quite nice. It's a little bit dry, but um, it's quite buttery. I think there's some butter or cream in it or something. Right, what else we got? I think we have some um, some cauliflower as well, some cauliflower cheese. Here we go. Mm. It's a little bit watery. I think it's been well cooked. Um, Actually, no, it's not. It's quite. That's odd. Right. Okay. It's been. Um, it's slightly dehydrated because it's been finished off in the oven with the cheese on it. That's how I think it's been made. Sometimes with cauliflower cheese, they put um, a cheese sauce, which makes it very moist. This one's dry, but um, well, well, I say well cooked. It's not actually. Yeah. 
they call it al dente so it's better than it falling apart I suppose bit more gravy mm. that's quite nice that gravy I think they use <clears throat> looking at the consistency of it it has it, a tad meat juices used in it that's not um, gravy granules that's made that although there might be some in it it's definitely yeah, like a proper gravy that they've used here although they do uh, a vegetarian gravy as well but that's not it well what a lot of food for three pounds 29 I'll definitely be doing this again Although I might share it next time, see if anyone wants to go halves on it. That's a lot of food that is. I think I'll try and squeeze a little bit more in but I'm nearly beaten with this I'll have to save it for later I'll just give you a view on how much is left a lot it will get eaten it won't get wasted that one but a good way to save money you know too good to go if anyone wants to do it
Okay, um, two good to go box, £3.29 from Nickelodeon, uh, which is a Green King chain. Uh, very good. I like the way that they give you a, a tub for the gravy and allow you to put what you want into the box, which is good. Um, I would have liked a surprise, but and the ease of just collecting a box and taking it out instead of having to put it in yourself. Uh, but anyway, I got to choose what I wanted, and as much as I wanted, um, perhaps a little bit more than I should have had for the price, but you know, they gave you a box that's that size, so you put what you can in it. Okay, thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye.